Lincoln Pierce is one of the greatest authors of all time along with Jeff Kinney and D.A.V. Pilkey. Pierce has written many big name books which have turned into a TV show, and recently started a relatively new book series called Max and the Midnights. How did Lincoln Pierce get here and what challenges did he face along the way? It all began on 1963, October 23rd, where Lincoln Pierce was born in Ames, Iowa. Throughout schooling, Lincoln liked to draw and frequently made comics about teachers and superheroes. Lincoln went to Colby College for four years, where he created a comic strip called Third Floor. He said it was basically a Doonesbury ripoff. From 1985 to 1987, he studied at Brooklyn College in New York, where he earned his MFA in studio art. MFA is an abbreviation for Master of Fine Arts. After this, he worked three years at Xavier High School, where he was an art teacher and a baseball coach, getting to spend a lot of time with kids, which may or may not have been the inspiration for Big Nate or to write books intended for kids. In 1989, Lincoln Pierce created something called Neighborhood Comics. This would later be changed to Big Nate, which is the comic we all know and love. He got the name because he called his brother John Big Nate, so he was already attached to the name and chose it for the comics. It would be 1991 when Big Nate would get syndicated and Lincoln Pierce would begin creating a Big Nate comic almost every day, still going to now. You can read a daily Big Nate comic on gocomics.com seeing fresh new comics, without having to wait for a new book which collects them in a compilation. Big Nate and More Babes was published in 1992, containing some of the earliest Big Nate comics to exist. The year would be 2009 when Big Nate got added to Pop Tropica, which was a very popular Flash game created by Jeff Kinney who also wrote Diary of a Wimpy Kid. Sad that they got rid of all the classic islands. It was March 23, 2010 when Lincoln Pierce would publish the very first Big Nate novel named Big Nate in Class by Himself. This was the very beginning to the greatest book series of all time. Sorry Diary of a Wimpy Kid fans. Later in 2010, Big Nate Strikes Again was published after the smashing success of the first Big Nate novel. Lincoln must have been super excited by how popular Big Nate turned out to be. Also sometime in 2010, the Big Nate website was released, including cool games and other features which sadly no longer exist because of the discontinuation of Flash. In 2011, Big Nate on a Roll was published, and also in 2011 Andrews McMeal Publishing began a series of Big Nate compilations in which the daily comics put in the newspapers were made into books. Big Nate activity books began equally in 2011 with the first being Big Nate Boredom Buster, and so on. If you haven't ever had one, they're really cool. In 2012, Big Nate Goes for Broke was published. Also in 2012, Big Nate Comics by You was released. This game allows you to create your own Big Nate comics. Just like the website, this also no longer exists. Big Nate Detention Dash was also released in 2012, probably along with Big Nate Busted which is a card game, and Detention Dash is a board game. In 2013 and 2014, Big Nate Flips Out and Big Nate in the Zone are created by Lincoln Pierce and published. Also in 2014, Lincoln Pierce teamed up with school kids, librarians, and teachers from all over America to create the longest comic strip in the world. The length was 1,214.07 meters, which is three quarters of a mile. Not only was the longest comic strip ever created, Big Nate the Musical was made and published by Samuel French. In 2015, Big Nate Lives It Up was published. In 2016, Lincoln Pierce published the last of the Big Nate novels which would be Big Nate Blasts Off. It's been eight years since the time making this video. So I doubt there will be any more as Lincoln Pierce hasn't announced anything yet. Little Big Nate was published in 2019, which is a children's book starring Nate. Now let's get to the new novel series. Lincoln Pierce published a new book which he had been teasing called Max and the Midnights. It was January 8th, 
2019 when the first Max and the Midnight's book was published. Personally, I didn't like the book and Big Nate is far superior along with Wimpy Kid. In 2020 and 2022, two more Max and the Midnight's books are published, created by Lincoln Pierce. February 17, 2022, the Big Nate TV show premiered on Paramount+. Plus. I made a video on the show and how to fix it, but in short it was trash. As of now, in 2023 season 2 of the Big Nate TV show was released. Not sure if there's much of an audience for that. Also Lincoln Pierce is 60 years old, and Nate will be turning 33 years old. Thanks for watching Big Nate fans. Peace.